Well, welcome back everybody. Today, we're going back to work on the camper. It's been forever, I know. But uh, we're going back to work on it today and we're gonna start working on the kitchen. So we just got in recently our Dometic CFX 45 fridge and that's what we've been waiting on for the kitchen because I didn't want to build out anything in here until I knew exactly how big our refrigerator was going to be because that's kind of one of the really important parts and the biggest item. So we've got our stove and our fridge. We're going to start over here. This is where the fridge is going to go and hopefully if everything works out right the stove will be on a slide underneath it. So we'll have the fridge slides out and then the stove slides out past that so that I mean, it's, we can open the fridge as it is here but it's going to come up another several inches and we want it to be accessible and we also want to be able to access this storage space back here from back here so we're not wasting any space if possible so that's what we're going to work on today i got some big heavy duty sliders um, that we're going to be using they're locking Super excited to see how those work. I think they're gonna work really good. They're really heavy duty, which is what I want for the amount of weight that's gonna be holding this. So, super excited to get the kitchen done. This is one of the best things that's gonna be done. And it'll make everything flow so much better at camp, just with food storage, food prep, meal prep. It's, it's gonna be good. So, let's get to work. So the first thing I need to do is actually take out this piece of plywood that's the floor. If you remember way back when, when I built the floor, all this is strips of wood. It's stripped every so often, and that is construction adhesive down to the metal. There's no, the, the plywood is screwed to the one by pieces, but other than that, there's nothing holding this down to the metal. Up there, that's fine. Back here, I don't think that's good enough because we're gonna have drawers, we're gonna have the fridge sliding out, we have a lot of weight wanting to pull this floor up, and I don't trust that adhesive. It might be fine, I don't trust it though. So we're gonna yank this floor up, and then I've got some 5 16 carriage bolts. We're gonna drill through, we're gonna bolt this all the way through the metal to underneath, and bolt this piece of plywood down. I've, I intentionally have a seam right here so that I could pull this up and do this. I also have a wire. Um, down here underneath this that I need to pull out that's part of our power for the fridge or anything else back here. So that's going to be step one.
it up. Yeah. through here those are all going through with metal that'll be good and solid and it'll have to rip a whole lot out to be able to fall out even with all the weight on it and we got a wire up through here so we can do a power outlet right there for the fridge another wire over here for another power or lights or whatever we need it for probably another power outlet but that one we'll use for the fridge more than likely so all right now it's time to start building the mounts for the fridge and stove.